Darwin Nunez has had his fair share of doubters since signing for Liverpool in an £85 million move this summer. The Uruguayan endured a slow start to life at Liverpool as he failed to show his true capabilities in their opening preseason games against Manchester United and Crystal Palace. Numerous videos emerged mocking the 23-year-old following his displays in these games. Nunez silenced the doubters after scoring four and just one half against RB Leipzig last week. But he didn't perform as well in Liverpool's 1-0 defeat at the hands of RB Salzburg on Wednesday evening. Nunez started the game but failed to make an impact before being subbed at halftime. And, following the game, another cruel video has emerged mocking his display. Created by Twitter user at Alliance underscore SCB19. The 46 seconds long video is titled, Darwin Nunez Making Easy Things Look Impossible. Nunez is seen failing to beat players, losing the ball and being thwarted in his attempts to find the back of the net. The video has gone viral, attracting over 6.5k retweets at the time of writing. Nunez scored 4 in 45 minutes less than a week ago and yet the trolls are out in force once again. He didn't have his best game against Salzburg, that must be said. But it is only preseason and ultimately these games are of little importance. Liverpool legend Robbie Fowler recently said it was ludicrous how much slander Nunez has received. It was ludicrous to think that Nunez was being doubted after playing just a few minutes against Manchester United and Crystal Palace on the tour to Asia, he wrote in his column for the Mirror, per the Liverpool Echo. He got a taste of what any big money signing faces in football these days if they're not scoring in every game, but it's ridiculous. Nunez has come to Liverpool off the back of a fantastic campaign at Benfica, and Jurgen Klopp has bought him for the next few years, not for one preseason. I'd seen that Klopp was perfectly happy with the way the lad has slotted into the club and his performances and training. And if Klopp's pleased that's all that matters.